I just treated myself to a new recorder, sound recorder, the Zoom H1N. So at the moment, I am just using the microphone in the helmet connected directly to the camera. I hope you're going to stop. No, you're not. Fucking just wait. <laughs> See what the quality is like with just the microphone. And the reason why I'm doing this test is because I'm going to then use the sound recorder connected to the microphone then from the my connected to the microphone start again the sound recorder the microphone connected to the sound recorder and then this is a load of crap the whole fucking thing is shit well this is a nice day to do a test Makes a change. Right, I've just treated myself to a new sound recorder. And it's the Zoom H1N. I'm not using it at the moment. I'm just using my normal microphone in the helmet, straight plugged into the camera. Because I want to see if there is a difference when I use the recorder. So we do a quick test how it sounds in this way around with just a microphone straight to the camera. And when I finish this little ride I'll do a turn around and come back on the same road. Uh, but that time I will use the sound recorder, the Zoom H1N. There's a good bike. And uh, I will plug the microphone straight to the sound recorder and then from the sound recorder plug that straight into the camera. So don't have to do any hand clapping to sync because it will be done automatically because I've got everything connected to the camera. It would only record when I press record. And as I leave on the Zoom H1N on, continuous, it would only record what is picked up from that. Simple. So we try. I shall find a nice shady spot here, stop, put the leads on, and turn around and go back. Right. Turn around now. Second part of the test. I have now the Zoom H1N connected to the camera. I've used the microphone lead going straight to the zoom recorder and then from the recorder headphone socket straight to the camera. So therefore the sound is being filtered through the recorder before it goes to the camera and hopefully that way it will improve the sound. The sound quality of this wonderful brilliant video that is rice hello rice they lay it on the ground to dry it out and then once it's dry they put it in these like very 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 large trays made of bamboo a wicker very thin and then they chuck it in the air and catch it again and while it's in the air they do it on a windy day by the way and the wind will blow away what's holding the rice. I forget what they call that. I sound a bit of a muppet now. Anyway, so you end up having rice falling down and the other stuff that covers the rice blow away. That's the theory. And it works. They do it. A very long process. Growing rice is a long process. Anyway, let's see if this sounds better than part one of this test. It's the rainy season over here in Vietnam at the moment, well in our part of Vietnam, because the season seems to spread it across the country. The whole country doesn't get the same season at the same time. And there you are, very mucky water. 
all the way from those mountains up there it travels a long way around 130 k's maybe more so folks that's the end of this test let me know what you think test one or test two test one is straight to the camera the microphone test two is to the recorder I wonder if you can see these dragonflies flying around can you well when we see this happening the locals say rain is on the way and I have to say I've been here what 13 years over that and it is a fact it's even happened when it's just sheer blue sky and you're thinking no way it's going to rain and then with a few hours it comes so guys thank you for listening and watching please let me know subscribe as well so we can carry on this wonderful game of vlogging and I will put out other videos catch you all later